Lance Foe, now a supporter, knew this midday former mayoral candidate Taylor Royal endorses incumbent Mayor Gene Stothert for her re-election bid. It's a big boost for Stothert's campaign as the general election is drawing closer. The Omaha general election race continues to tighten for the mayor's seat. 3 News Now reporter Shante Passmore is live at Stothert's campaign headquarters with more. Shante. Emily Matt, just days ago, Taylor Royal touted that he was not a career politician, even going as far as to say unlocking new sources of growth, moving Oma forward would not come from a politician. But just today, he's singing a different tune, throwing his full support behind the mayor. Admittedly, he says they don't always see eye to eye on a number of things, including the restaurant tax and proposed streetcar, but says there is more that unites us than divides us. It's a number game right now, of course. Mellow trailed Stothert by three percentage points in the primary with Royal coming in third with a little over 6,000 votes. So the big question right now is, will Royal supporters go for Stother? I believe that, uh, you know, my message and, and vision really resonated with a lot of different people, millennials, uh, hardworking uh, men and women, and people who may have not necessarily been involved in the political process before. I uh, do think that it provided a good uh, conservative and principled voice to this race, and I believe that they see that it's a clear option to support Mayor Stothert uh, in for her re-election. As for Stothert's take on the endorsement, based on her first mayoral run four years ago, she says, you want other candidates to come vote for you once the primary is over. Getting on board with your vision and after endorsement, Mello's campaign manager says, quote, it's ironic that this endorsement comes less than 48 hours after Mayor Stothert hit the gas pedal on the street car by committing $30 million of taxpayer dollars to the project. Stothert now says the street car project will be in the voters' hands. Reporting live, Shante Passmore, 3 News Now, Midday. Thanks, Shante. Tonight, Dundee residents will get to know the mayoral candidate.